Saturday morning, very early, Lillian found Michael sitting alone in the kitchen. He turned ashen when he saw her, his hands dropping quickly to his lap. Michael, I know you have a cell phone. No need to hide it. His eyes were ever so serious. Well, you don't much care for it, Mom. She ignored that. You look awful worried. He hesitated. It's a text from Elizabeth. She must have sent it last night, he muttered. Didn't check messages till just now. Everything all right? Lillianne asked. He shrugged, suddenly acting casual. Well, you know, it's hard to tell about her. Lillianne stared at the cell phone in his hands, her heart racing. How she longed to know where their dear granddaughter was after all these months. When was the last time you heard something? A few weeks, maybe. Michael's voice was quiet, like he could barely get enough breath to speak. He pressed a button, which caused the screen to blacken. I just texted back. I'm sure we'll hear more soon.